Welcome everyone to my new video on Litecoin price analysis and technical details, predictions and everything that's important. It is 3rd of July 2023 and we're going to talk about around this amazing cryptocurrency which is outperforming everything and everyone. 23% for the past 7 days, doing extremely well. By the way, do not forget to subscribe to the main YouTube channel as well, where I have ChatGPT bot trading videos. By the way, if you'd like to participate in our ChatGPT bot trading, no prior fee, only commission from the performance, which is paid by you. All the trading goes outsourced on API. I'll talk about it at the end. Now, let's see what's going on, folks, on the CoinMarketCap side. Meanwhile, Litecoin has been dealing with the momentum gain around the halving. This is what usually happens. You get major milestones, major announcements that is collecting a lot of the media attention, which is then promoting you. And this chain effect builds a specific perception towards people that is generating the action, usually the action of buying. At the same time, when you have news of the opposite sector, it's generating the reactions of selling. For example, when we had the Binance Coinbase SEC problem two weeks ago, there was been a major panic selling going around where a lot of the things were have been afraid of, their resources getting blocked or all sorts of terrible scenarios. So the point of the media is extremely important in the space of crypto, as you can see. Now, what are the charts presenting us? Simply said, we have a very interesting momentum. We were talking about a weird type of an Elliott wave impulse with the movement number five that is triggering the 1.272 Fibonacci level. I've been talking about that for a while, which is exactly what has happened. We have been confirming support on number four representation of the Elliott wave impulse breaking out of the golden level, breaking out of any possible trending resistance of two very interesting channels that we had. And then we actually got stuck at 1.272 Fibonacci retracement level. And this is following up with an extension price action. So what we have here is a lot of liquidity being built. I'm a bit afraid that there is, you know, very difficult to deal with higher numbers from now without generating a pullback, without generating a retracement. That would be healthy if you're asking me. I mean, you know, LTC got to fly back to the $100, test some of those levels, see what are we up to with those and then trigger movements that could continue as soon as BTC wants to go up to $40,000, Litecoin will cross 130, but it has to come back, cannot continue basically increasing without pulling back. The increasing momentum has been 41% in four days. Do you guys know how many people had leverage trading with Litecoin, especially out of my students on the one-on-one -on -one coaching or the trades that we performed for our people with our ChatGPT bot trading? There's been so many people, we actually exited out of the trades and we're dealing right now with some great numbers on the side. We have USDT, we're waiting for better opportunities. You need to keep in mind that if there is $5 to be made, there might be $10 to be made the next day or in a different trade. So you need to consider that for each action you're doing, you need to take the best responsibility and the highest efficient rate for your resources. If you have $100, do not use that $100 in a trade that gives you the ability to make 3% when there are trades that have ability to make 6%. And you are not going to have resources to handle the 6% one, you're dealing with a 3% one. You always need to maximize that, which is why you need to learn how to do this business. Besides the fact that we're looking for a healthy pullback, I'm not suggesting to long Litecoin at this levels without pulling back down. Or if we range here, that is another thing, a minor pullback would be expected before the market brawl is again in terms of the LTC price. On the other side of the thing, we have the MDN oscillator that is finding difficulties at this level, right? So it's having, you know, difficulties. You can see that on the bottom of the page, which kind of shows that the bullish pressure is decreasing. We're about to cross the indicator line and we have the bearish pressure, the selling pressure increasing too. 
It doesn't mean we cannot form a convergence here and break below by showcasing an indicator behavior. It is definitely possible. Let's not forget about that. We need to be very, very patient because we're during the summertime where things can move, but at the same time, the volatility index can overcome these issues by representing miscellaneous, by representing a mistype of understanding of how does the data shows. So make sure to stick with us till the end, folks. Once again, subscribe to the main channel. And if you want to be part of the bot trading, only commission from the pure profits achieved, where we perform the trading for you to API permission, completely outsource. Check out our weekly performance here. And on the right side, it's explained how you can participate. Contact me. You have the email right there or simply complete the form to join us. You can also find out more amongst our videos, including the one on one coaching. If you think education is important to generate extra resources, whether you talk about part-time or full-time trading, get yourself educated at the highest level you can and act accordingly with your principles. This is a one-on-one -on -one coaching live with me between four to six weeks where intensively I will teach you how to trade. I've been trading since 2014, but you can watch the video to find out more, register now to qualify for a free conversation with me where I can explain you more and looking forward to it, guys. Have a good time. Subscribe to the channel and like the video.